What's the deal, world? I go by the name of Biz Biller. This is episode five of BYC's Gaming's Let's Play, Play Now, whatever you want to call it. But it's really called Chill With Me, Pete and Miles. I go by the name of Biz Biller once again. This is BYC Gaming. Bring your controller. Spider-Man 2, man, episode 5. Uh, been a little, little minute since we tapped back in. I've been playing Call of Duty. I've been playing the story mode offline. I, I don't really get into the story mode for uh, streaming purposes. I don't know. It's just not my thing. I like to enjoy the story, listen, have the headphones on, hear all the action going on in the Call of Duty world. So we'll be bringing you Call of Duty live tomorrow. That will be going down uh on model warfare 3 we're gonna test that out on the release um as y'all know we got ufc that's been rough for us uh if y'all have followed our light heavyweight um we'll see how that goes it's, man we pushing towards a new character the way that's going 2k we got the fantasy nba season video dropping today that's out by the time this probably drops on youtube um what else we got we got the NBA 2K review, check that out, 2K24. We got the Madden New York Jets season. We got the New York Yankees season. They're fighting to dominate both of those teams in the playoffs. So we got a lot going on. Right now, this is all about me, Pete, and Miles. Let's get to it. Y'all can follow all things BYC Gaming in the links, wherever you're watching this at. Check us out on Linktree. You know what I'm saying? Let's get to work, man. All right, so we are Peter at the current time. Um, I was thinking about changing the outfit, but I think we're good with what we got on. Why did I jump twice? <laughs> All right, so let's get to a high point. Higher point. All right. And you see the beautiful Empire State Building. Um, there's a crime reported, but let's first of all see what we got going on story wise. Um, we've got healing the world. That's the main story mission. Okay, we've completed a lot of side stuff. We got Prowler stashes for miles. Um, the flame missions, we got that one out the way. Brooklyn Vision. So these are all missions for miles, if I'm not mistaken. So let's do a story mission. And then after that. Um, it's not even too far away either. We'll do this crime. We'll do the mission. Any other side stuff we'll see. And then we'll tap in with Miles. And, um, get some of his school missions out of the way. Ooh. You know, that was smooth. I'm not going to lie, Parker. That was smooth. Because I definitely thought I messed up right there. Uh-oh. Gas truck. Where is it at? Oh, it's down there. Well, look who's in the neighborhood. Oh man, I messed up. Oh, that's, well, that's Miles. At least I won't be fighting. Ooh. 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 Incoming heat. Pun intended. Ooh. Ooh. They are getting physical, yo. Oh. Yes, sir. How did he... Whoa. Alright, 
who else wants some of this? Yeah, he put up a fight. All right, come on, Miles. How do I do it? How do I do it? Oh! <laughs> How do I... I forgot, bro. Uh, see? That's <laughs> not how I was supposed to go down, bro. Yo, those firefighters. Yo. <sighs> Dog, that was not supposed to happen like that at all. At all, at all, at all. Spider Man getting shifty with it. And here we are at the Emily May Foundation. Let's see what's going on next. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this, but my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him... Aside for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... He got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission, to heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, the carnivorous bee wolf. So we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. 
Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Coming for you, bee wolf! Wow. Holds on while shooting at the hive. <laughs> A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to Entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. My dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. All right, so we'll take this chance. For everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. I'll take this chance to be nosy. Can we interact with people? Oh. Okay, so there's some machines we nice. can interact with. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up. I'm Millie Rock on any block. Hey. I'm Millie Rock on any block. Hey, hey, I believe rock on any block. Right. <laughs> That's cool though. They got a little um mechanical arm. That's cool. That is cool. I was actually gonna go that way at first and I'll go back. So Harry's put something together here. So much to see here. Where do I even start? So was ha Harry was the hobgoblin, right? The meat and mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue.
This is so interesting. Uh, so, I want to see. Pardon me, y'all. My microphone got a little, little caught up there. I but as much as I, can right now. I want to see what else is throughout the facility. Okay, so that's the uh, elevator. We'll come back that way when we want to go finish up and pardon me. We'll go that way. We want to check uh, Harry. We'll go up there in a second. This through before signing on. That's probably his main uh, hesitation in taking this opportunity. As he just said, <laughs> you know, when you're Spider Man, you just can't live a regular life, man. You can, but you can't. <laughs> cool fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah. Japanese koi fish have well-studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. So cool! May would have loved this place. They see Peter taken back by this whole situation. I'll see what these bikes are heading on. Did you see the monthly schedule I I did, and I was very Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. I wonder, can we go back into that area where yeah. hey, Doc Connor was? Are you ready? Come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. And I wonder, can I talk to... Oh, yeah, we can come in here. Beehives show complex group decision-making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. <laughs> Why he walked down on her like that? Battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. I mean, he really like <laughs> walked down on Shorty. I know she like yo dog. So more tests and stuff being done in there. I was trying to see could I talk to Connors, man. Is he in here somewhere? Oh, well, that is wonderful news. Do you know who's going to be heading that? Uh, I think it's uh, Pronsky. He's going to be in charge of that one. Hey, you see me eavesdropping on conversations. What we got going on over here? The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. Oh, wow. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of a successful outcome. Here at the Emily May Foundation, this cutting edge work is being put to use saving lives. Wow. Ops Court has the bag. They got the bag. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Attention, oh yeah, that would 
take a while. <laughs> sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? Wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Hmm. So we almost through. And apparently that's where we need to go like once we're done. Putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. Hmm. I don't see Doc Connor, so let's go ahead and wrap it up. Boy, he was probably upstairs, but we're heading upstairs, but to go ahead and see Harry now. Is that sound? You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school, to middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Hello? Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. So I guess it's good that we got ahead of the curve and checked out everywhere downstairs. Do some more exploring of the building later when we get another opportunity to. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Let's see.
Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. All right, making it look smooth. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Hmm, thought I had this one. Hmm. Okay, if I combine these traits. It's not that one. Hmm, that one's three, that one's three. Okay, let's try this. Wait, hold on. I can put this here. Take this one. Wait, how does it not go here? Oh, oh, okay, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, that there. Ah, uh, but that's not good there. Hmm. Okay, we need this one right here. Let's see. Okay, so it's not that one. Okay, so it's this one. Okay, it's not that one either. What the heck? I am starting off wrong. Okay, this is the one. That, that one conflicts with everything. Okay, this can't go there because the next one has to be a singular one on the right. So it has to be this one. Okay, saying it's not that, it's not that either. So where do I start? Because none of these, which one matches up in that upper right corner? Hmm. Okay, so this one has to go here. And either this one. Let's try. How does that not work? Oh, because there's not that many on the side. Ah! Okay. So maybe we go this way. This way. I think we finally got it, y'all. My goodness. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So hmm. now where? Last stop. It might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. 
But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Go ahead. Swipe. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> Peter's got a job. Good for you, Peter. Peter's got a job. Oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I track the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. Gotta do a thing. One sec. Hope Dr. Foster doesn't mind if Spider-Man helps. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. There has to be a healthy looking plant around here somewhere.
Is there a specific place I'm supposed to be looking for said plant? Let's scan these vines. He said, let's scan these vines. Am I missing something? Oh, here we go. Hmm. Here we go. This one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. Is that all we need? Do we need more? Yo, I need some tips, man. What am I supposed to do next? Okay, so I guess we're just supposed to explore. Anything in that tree? No. There we go. There's got to be some over here. I love how everybody's just so nonchalant. Spider-Man's like right above them. Wish I never started this mission. <laughs> I don't have time to be looking for plants right now, bruh. I don't see anything, bro. I mean, maybe I should go back to the plants I was looking at before down here. Am I supposed to go back to the vines? Am I supposed to do it for the vine? Where's it at, dude? Nothing behind me, nothing down here. What am I supposed to be doing? I'm sorry, y'all. Like, I'm so lost. This is why I usually don't play story mode games, because I get lost. And we sit and do the same thing. Was I supposed to put the thing back in here for the, like, can I get a hint? Can I get something, bro? Am I supposed to go further away from the area? I don't land them, landing on cars. I already came up here. Check over here. Well, you just gonna find random fruits and stuff in New York City, bro. Like, I'm not even under. I don't want to abandon the mission, but at this point, I guess I gotta stay in the area. Checked over there already. Checked over here. Feel like I checked over here as well. Do I need to go to higher ground? Um, huh? 
check up here. Is this a greenhouse? Yeah, I'm about to abandon this mission in a second, man. I don't know. I'll come back to these missions later. Maybe figure out what I'm supposed to be looking for. We were in the vines before. We looked over here. Yeah, I'm gonna abandon this mission. I don't want to waste no more of y'all time. <laughs> like, I don't know how much looking around I could do. We got actual stuff going on outside of looking for plants and crap like that. Like, we'll get we'll get back to that later, unless along the way Peter, unless along the way Peter says something like, "Oh, there's a," you know what I mean? Because come on, bro. Sorry about that. And yeah, sorry, sorry about that indeed. What's up? Sheesh. Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. All right. Peter flying through the cities. Got to meet him by the Williamsburg Bridge. Let's see what's popping over there in there, Brooklyn. BK Town. Brooklyn style. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Oh, man, we were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find it. Littering? Come on, man. Spider Man goes down. I'm definitely rusty, but hopefully I'll step it up on this next round. Where's your 
boss take Lee and Gargan? The criminals? Not far. They're enjoying their freedom. That's not ominous at all. Ooh. Spider Man got to stay on the move. this oh that was just a thing telling me to zoom over so okay right, we should be good for now here? maybe it'll lead me to some answers okay birdie take me to your nest gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline is going through the city like it's an obstacle oh, course. Oh, you won't miss Never it. Getting to do real science, though. For actual money. Oh, my God. I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. You daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Is that a real gun that actually works? Oh. Peter staying out of the way of the rail gun shots. Cruising through this Sandman damage area. Nice cloaking tech. Mind if I take a look under the hood? Oh. I'll take that as a no. Two cloaks now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. He's in the air. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. You know, I've got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. And yet you always held back. By not killing him? Yeah, killing really isn't my thing. Spider-Man doing work. Where's your boss? Where's the computers at? Oh, there they are. Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Birdie, this is just as awkward for me as it is for you. <laughs> there should be a... Yep. Oh, is that your home? Ooh. Oh, come on, Birdie, let go! Come on! Stop my ticket for this ride! Sheesh. Coming back to Earth strong. I about to say I'm definitely putting web wings on. Maybe she can take up some building records. Where are we going now? Dropping in hot. Hey, 
MJ, did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait, this buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city, like whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I'm gonna find out. Good luck. Need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. So what am I to do? They want me to wait? Gotta drop one of them away. Oh, okay. Shooting webs. Okay. Scan for distractions. We got that one right there. Is there any other ones? I was just curious. All right. Aim at the generator. So pretty much it's still teaching us to play the game. So that's how you do the purse takedown. Okay. Got it. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Connection oh, and good. speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. All right, so we'll use this one. Let's just make sure we don't have any distractions. Okay. Okay, so the purse takedown is going to be the same as the uh so as i'm assume drop down okay and this will be triangle oh no square a lot of gear it's like they're prepping for war So we got a wall takedown. Okay, so similar to the perch. Craven, that's their leader. All right. Uh oh, was I not quick enough? Like, what did I do wrong? Trying to get up here, buddy? Trying to get up here? Well, I'll help you. I'll help you. Fire at him. Ooh, punching him against the wall. Up against the wall. Oh, where I'm coming back. Did me for that to get that loud. That's everyone. Now, what were they up to? Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others all around the city. I'll send this to Genki, but he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? Why? Yes, it's loaded. So I'll join you soon. Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. Wow. 
You hungry too? You could use a break. Somebody else in here? Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Nice. Interesting, he's taking in all this tech. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Cloaking fields operation. Beatles, hmm. Dalandrons, ammunition, rations. Hmm. Still missing some shipments. I'll have to pay that yardmaster a visit. These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich. Or well connected. Or both. Did anybody hear that? See if I can get this guy. Is he by himself? Oh, he's not. Fuck. Put it down with webs. All right, where to next? Looks like this is the only way. A research lab? Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal, ugh. that's the Tiara Abitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to Riotea? Guess Craven could. Craven making moves. And not a single scratch. Mm. Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can mm. be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. You need to call Miles, my boy. You about to run into some smoke, Pete. Hey, MJ. I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. And he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. 
What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. How many more fires must we light up in the city? As many as we need to. Craven said they surrounded him in his dream. But if his dream is accurate, then the fires are fated to happen anyway. Why not wait for them? They will happen on his terms, not fates. No stuff, no stuff this time for me. What the heck was that? Spider-Man coming with that smoke. I'm trying to do a movie. I see I keep picking them up. I'm trying to slam them down, but I think I'm supposed to move. Ooh, took some shots right there. Oh, say Spider-Man, use your... Use your stuff, Spider-Man, whatever. Whatever you got in the arsenal, use it. Sick of these guys with the guns. Here you go, heal, heal, heal. Oh, I'm stuck. Whoo! These shots be firing. for my in life Ooh. I love how when I dodge it they're shooting their own guys sick detail right there Y'all have more than enough of y'all. Ooh. That was nice. Yeah, you come down here. You doing all that. Come here. Come here. You gonna get it the worst. Nobody told you to get out. Sheesh. Some answers instead of questions right now. That looks promising. All right, Craven, what are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. I 
Never gonna win best in show with that attitude. Go. Nice doggy kitty robot. <laughs> Not roll. Ro. <laughs> Those teeth are no joke. Ooh, can't get out of the way of that. That dog down. Who is this? Why are you walking up on me like that, bro? What's wrong with you? <laughs> you don't walk down on me like he know me, sir. You know who I am? I didn't even see him over there. I just, I just was diving down there. Take out this beast real quick. Actually, now that you're here, question: What's Raven hunting? Maybe I can help. You won't live long enough to help anyone. Wanna bet? Another one of these things. Guys, putting together quite the team. Nice 
Is this the best you can do? They said you were a killer. Imagine my disappointment. Whoa, wasn't expecting that. Spider-Man just got to watch it on IG Live. <laughs> Yo. Teaming up with supervillains for some hunt. There is prey. Hmm. Felicia. For what? En serio. My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. <sighs> Can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. I see you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? I'm sorry. Next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. So I found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters, as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name, Craven. And he killed Scorpion, and he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee? Don't know, but this list is extensive. These must be the people Marco warned us about. They were hunting Sandman. No way. He's just on their list, too. Black Cat, your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you! Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up, and... We're going to find Lee on this. I promise. Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? Maybe I should try to find some hunter hideouts. one to homecoming but it looks like things got out of hand did they overdo it like one of those gender reveal things sounds less dramatic than that i think it's kind of sweet yeah you're right okay on my way sorry guys but beach day is canceled 
Sand crystals all mine now. I lose the grapes at the school and come home. Walk through the front door. But you're not there. They are. What have they done to you, Kimia? The hunters were after him. Craven's real evil for having his people drag Marco's kid into this. I gotta find more crystals to figure out what went down. Marco's memory is returning and he's agitated. The doctors are piecing together what happened. It, it sounds like it's not all his fault. Let me know if I hear more. Addresses Pete mentioned for a few black cat safe houses. Heading to the first one now. Thanks for offering to do this. He can get kind of blindsided by Felicia. I know you're busy with your college essay. It's cool. I always have time to Spider Man. Sounds like you're as good at work life balance as I am. I'm scrambling to finish my hunter story. I saved my job. But you guys, what happened to Scorpion and Lee in the wind? Can't focus while he's out there, MJ. Don't. Don't let it eat you up. Might be best to just focus on the task at hand. That's not all. When I face Lee, I got some new powers. They're blue and weird. Uh, I mean, I'm no expert on spider powers, but... C could it be from stress? What you're going through, it, it's a lot. But you're not alone. Even Pete and I... We're still figuring it all out. One thing at a time, right? We'll find him. I know. Thanks, MJ. And Miles, be careful with Felicia. You can't trust her, no matter what she says. Warn her about the hunters and get her out of the city. Understood. Let you know when I get there. Found him! Hi! I'm with the fire brigade!
body report that Lance was kidnapped. That Lance? He can be anywhere. Who took him? No clue. But if anyone can find him, it's you. And not the wildest thing I've attempted all week. I'm in. So here we go, we're going across the water, we're going to do this last mission for his people in Brooklyn, and then we will go and call it a day for episode 5. It's actually quicker to go across the water than some of the other ways. Like hitting a bridge and all that, it's quick. Even if you do dip inside the water for a quick second. I definitely got, I thought I bought that, uh, that one unlock where you can swing around the buildings i think i'm going to pick that up eventually um and before i do this mission let's check the suit tech and all this stuff health health upgrades hero tokens tech parts it's definitely increase the health we could definitely use that um damage Okay, we're getting our weight up. Okay, now we got focus. Improve focus, allow you to heal and form more effectively. Okay. Definitely can use that. Maybe I would have been better at the game by now if I had done some of this stuff. Okay, and traversal. Glide from longer with wet wings. That's pretty cool. An explosive boost when propelling you further. Okay. Um, we'll we'll come to the suits last. Um, gadgets. Okay. Now the skills. We've got two skill points for each of them. And what's the speed rush? Spider rush webs up three. Oh, no, nah, come on. That's fire. Either that or oh, and, it's, and it's one. Press the shock enemies. Nah, that's cool, but that's where it's at. Okay, so I stand corrected. That one point was, was between all three Options if you use venom jump on only one target to recharge immediately after performing the follow up with neither one of these really that crazy. All right, and lastly, let's look at the suits. Have we got anything new? That's sick. That's also, wow, that is sick. We don't have this one yet. Okay, we got a few more things to knock out. We got this one. I'm gonna go, black to, go back to that one for Miles. That one is sick. And now Peter, that's fire. Um, man, he's got some options. 
We'll come back to that a little bit later. Don't you guys have like a huge game against them tomorrow? That's the whole point. Look, they explained it in this note. If you're reading this, you're probably a wannabe scientist from BV. But you'll have to do some midtown level science to finish our puzzle and get Lance back. Don't worry, though. If you don't, we'll make him look real nice in front of everyone. Good luck. Here's your first, first clue. The boat has sailed, but you should steer. You'll solve our puzzles engineered. Hmm. I'm pretty sure that note leads to the Stewart building, but we can't access the roof. See why we called you? Yeah, I'll look around. Mm, that RJ kid. I knew not to hold the door for him. The Spider Man on the top of the basket. That's fire. I got this. Lance can have gone far by himself. Wait. The Stewart building? Wonder why the Midtown kids took Lance there. Did you find him already? Not quite. But I have to know. Why the Stewart building? A BB kid won a robotics contest against Midtown at Stewart Robotics and Engineering last year. Midtown lost. Sounds like Midtown is super bothered about it. They'll be even more bothered when we get Lance back. It looks like the right place. Midtown Science Club is legendary for their pranks. It looks like RJ left another note. Hmm. Okay. If I want to find Lance, I'll need to shine the UV light on the mural somehow. Yank mirrors. Hmm. Maybe I can angle these beams. Oh, okay. Hmm. Can't get that out the way. Sweet. And I gotta just connect. BIPOC artists are birds of a feather. To find the next clue, all a band together. Hmm. BIPOC artists. Haley's art expert. Let me give her a call. I heard you're looking for Lance. Did you find him? Not yet. Midtown's making us work for it. But I could use your help. Sending you a pic. BIPOC artists. Birds of a feather. Hmm. There's a bunch of BIPOC murals at Rodney and Third. Don't know what Alaband means, though. Thanks, Haley. I owe you one. That thank you was plenty. But I'm always down for coffee. You got it. All right. Should be getting close. If I could stop <laughs> doing tricks for one second and just get there. Is it really hard to try to that, that hard to just try to land in here? Gotta be a hidden message on one of them. How 
we doing? I'll find man soon. I think. Midtown hidden messages on murals around town. Right now I'm at Rodney and Third, trying to find the next clue. Where Anders Oliband's painting is? <laughs> Makes sense. Oliband? Midtown mentioned him in the clue. But who is he? Evie's own premier art prodigy turned research fellow at the Musée de la Vie in Paris? Maybe Midtown's jealous they don't have an alum like that. Okay, that one's going there, this one's going there. That one's going down here, this one hits there. What am I missing? Okay. Sorry about that, wasn't aiming correctly. We got this one here. We'll spin it. Spin it to win it. The Finally. Is stiff, but your tactics are stale. The greatest in the region shall soon prevail. Hey, Haley, got another clue for you. Sent a pick. Hmm. Greatest in the region. If it's about another mural, you might want to try North Williamsburg. Didn't BV and Midtown have a chess match there last week? Yes. Regionals. Ended in a stalemate. Aha. Uh -huh. That explains why Midtown's so bitter. I'll check it out. Two hmm. murals this time? Man, Midtown really doesn't want us to find Lance. Good thing Brooklyn Visions has Spider-Man on their side. Red and blue flags. Could there be two paths? Man, where'd they get all this equipment? This setup is impressive. Like, ridiculously impressive. So there are two paths then. Gotta hand it to Midtown. They spent some serious time on this one. So we're trying to break this puzzle down. Um... Street has hundreds of locations. I need more details. Wait, why didn't the second one light up? There must be more to do. Okay, so we're trying to get it to right there. So it might take that one, right? We don't have time to set this up. <laughs> we want one to go with these red ones. So where can we change that path at? Hmm. I guess if this I have time to be back here. They've got time to set up an elaborate puzzle around the city. Hmm. Let's see, where do we start at? Back here. I'm gonna get this. It's gonna take me a second. But I'm gonna get this. There we go. We already starting off well. Okay, now that one. 
is going there now. Can't see, but then it's hitting there. Hmm. Trying to re retrace my steps. Okay. So we know everything is pretty much starting right here. So let's start it like this. Okay, so that goes there. That goes here to this one. Then this goes into that. That's probably what we don't want. Probably want to go in there to there and back across. All right, let's see. So we got to move this one into the red now. Okay. One, one, two, one. That must be the street number. Finally. Okay. What's it say? One, one, two, one Main Street. That must be where they're hiding Lance. Miles, speak on it. I think I found Lance. 1121 Main Street. Knew I could count on you. There's like a million Main Streets everywhere across America, but this is the one we're looking for. Lance, you around here, buddy? Maybe he's in here. Lance <laughs> the Lion. Time for you to head home. One of you must be RJ. Spider-Man? No fair. Brooklyn Vision's cheated. Whoa, Spider-Man? Guess BB couldn't figure it out on their own. Thanks for the fun and games. But I've got to get this guy home. <laughs> Any luck? On my way back. And I'm bringing a fluffy friend. Lance, you found him. Is he okay? Did it hurt him? I don't know why I can't hear them. Anyway, hurry back. We're all ready for him. On my way. Is this an actual mascot or just a, a stuff animal? Like, <laughs> what the thing? This is what they do to him. He's very. <laughs> Yeah, clearly that's a mascot costume. That uh, is a lively person. We're getting Lance back safe and just in time for the game. <laughs> Lance is about to get saucy. <laughs> there you go. He's still getting down over there. See you, Lance. <laughs> All right, man. But you people, I will be seeing y'all later. We're going to end it there. You know, BYC Gaming, man. Another episode, another day, another dollar. We appreciate everybody that taps in with the live on the playback. And if you like what you hear and you knew, be sure to follow us at BYC underscore gaming. I was trying to hit the trail, but I failed. It is all to the good. Y'all people be well. Me, Miles, and Pete. We're going to head out of here, man. You're peace.